This is the day that the Lord has made. We will rejoice and be glad in it. Wow, if there's like one scripture from the book of Psalm that you could take into your day, that I think would transform your day, have a powerful impact, it might be that one. Because you just think about how different that is in the world to approach your day um, with happiness, with gladness, with gratitude. It seems to be lost if you spend a lot of time on the internet or social media and read all of the comments that scroll under any news story. It just seems like everybody's angry. There's negativity. Happy people don't do all of those negative things that we see in the news. You know, happy people go about their day differently. So what if we went out today and we rejoiced and we were glad and we were happy? How much would that change our relationships and the way we go about our work and the way we go about helping others? I think it could be huge. I love the way uh, my friend Harry captured this in his book on mindset. There's no way to be optimistic if you're channeling your energy into either despairing over bad events or complaining about the injustice of them happening to you. Pessimism leads eventually to a sense of helplessness, the belief that nothing you choose to do will improve what happens to you. Helpless people can't win because their beliefs paralyze them from taking any action at all. If it's not going to make any difference, after all, what's the point of trying? I don't know about you, but I want to get out there and try. I don't want to give up. I don't want to be pessimistic. I don't want to believe that the things that I do don't make any difference. I don't think you think that way either. So let's get out there and rejoice and be glad and have an awesome day. I'll see you soon.